Hypertension is a very common disease. People think India is a diabetic capital, but hypertension is much, much more common than diabetes. In any given population, the prevalence of hypertension is double that of diabetes. It's a silent killer. Most of the time, people don't even know that they are hypertensive. By age of 50, 55, 90% of the population becomes hypertensive. That doesn't mean it starts at 50, 55. It starts way early. We have done school health studies where we have found the hypertension to be 3 to 4 percent even in school children and with time it increases more and more people become hypertensive and today's lifestyle hypertension is part and parcel of the uh, you know one's uh, uh, health now uh, the predictors of hypertension are overweight having sleep apnea lack of exercise lack of sleep these are the ones which predispose uh, people to be hypertensive there are myths about hypertension people think hypertension is associated with uh, uh, with short temper or it's uh, you know it's only people who are irritable it's not true uh, only way to pick up hypertension is to measure bp regularly there is no other way to pick up hypertension you'll be surprised there are people who are very calm and who have no absolutely who look very peaceful even they tend to be hypertensive now this is a silent killer most of the time people don't even know that they are hypertensive and they end up with the major complication when we ask them they keep telling that we had no symptom hence you know we didn't get it tested it's very important to get it tested and it's very easy to uh, test it any healthcare professional can check a bp there are electronic bp monitors now which are quite reliable so bp can be easily uh, checked at any any point the complications are very deadly and most of the time irreversible the most important complication of hypertension is actually stroke and intracranial bleed and both these could be very disabling and once it occurs it's very difficult to reverse it other important problem which hypertension produces is actually heart attack it also leads to heart failure where heart becomes very weak and the person become you know is very symptomatic when they walk uh, to prevent hypertension most imp there are lifestyle changes and there are drugs which can be used lifestyle means that lose weight at least 5 to 8 kgs and try to have a low salt diet it is not no salt it is low salt so whatever is there in the cooking is fine but added salt should be avoided good exercise especially in the morning is known to decrease the bp for whole whole day and also uh, five, uh, six to seven hours of sleep every day is must sleep is a must to prevent or even to control uh, hypertension Hypertension is a very deadly disease, but there are good effective medicines which are available to control hypertension. Once diagnosed to be hypertensive, it is very important that people try the lifestyle change. Lifestyle changes are must even if you are taking any medicine. But if it doesn't get controlled with lifestyle, it's important to use these medicines. Most of the time, these are used for lifelong, but then they do their job. Once the blood pressure is controlled, the damage produced by blood pressure is reduced considerably and it's very important to control blood pressure it's very important to have regular uh, checkups and test your uh, blood pressure it's not enough to just take medicine and think that the blood pressure is controlled it's important to go for regular checkup and make sure that the blood pressure is uh, controlled I, Dr. Ranjan Shetty, Head of Department of Cardiology, wanted to give the important message on hypertension that it is a silent killer. It's very important that we all, you know, uh, diagnose it and treat it effectively.